What's up, everybody? Tony Pizza Guy here, back with more WWE 12 info. Now, I gave a lot of info on WWE 12, and I figured that I would bring some more because there are some things that I actually missed in talking about WWE 12 that uh, are very crucial to the series. So, first off, the analog stick grap blah, 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 blah. the analog stick grapples will be replaced with traditional face button attacks. So what that means is that's kind of like the WWE All-Stars controls. I'm, I'm thinking they're going towards that kind of control system. They have also had a new animation system that lets you interrupt moves mid-flow, kind of like WWE All-Stars. Camera has been pulled back. Basically, they probably have different camera angles, so you're not so close in the action. The speed of the gameplay has been sped up, obviously. And new taunt system has been brought in to make the game feel more like the TV experience. So that is that. Um, they're changing the dynamic comebacks, which will give you a shot at coming back from a brink defeat to clear the ring. Which basically means, say you're getting beat up and beat up and beat up and beat up. There's a certain window of time that you have that you can actually basically Hulk up or John Cena up and come back and that is something new and the thing that I've been asking for for a long time is there's an improved AI system and the AI system will be able to detect if you're spamming moves so it will reverse more if you like to do running grapples like I do or if you like to do the same punches over and over it'll, it'll, it'll learn that and it will reverse them the other thing is also when you get up as you're doing moves, say that you start the match and you run after, you'll both get knocked down, but what will happen is you'll both get up at the same time. And what you have is you have a window of time to strike. It's kind of like No Mercy or Revenge or any of those games that you played. When you get up, you actually can hold a thing and you can do an attack from there. So as you're getting up, you can do an attack. So that's one of the other things that they have done there and I don't know what else there is to know about it one other thing that I do know is that the well I don't know his actual name but he's one of the community guys that works for THQ and they had actually asked questions on do you what did you like about GM mode what do you want to see improve this year so they did a little survey on that and that makes me think that they want to bring GM mode back or they want to incorporate that into the WWE Universe mode. Now they did say there is a new Universe mode. It is WWE 2.0 Universe or Universe 2.0, whatever you want to call it. But uh, Universe mode is back and I don't know how it's going to play out. They're probably adding more animations. So it's going to build on what they already have and make it better. And something else, I had been getting comments back and forth. Yes, I saw on GameSpot they or GameStop they said it was for PS2. No, I didn't see it was for PS2. Is it for PS2? Is it not for PS2? Well, the information that I have is that it's not going to be for PSP and it's not going to be for PS2. I've looked on IGN's website. I've looked on GameStop, and GameStop usually leaks stuff, even though they're not supposed to. They leak what systems it's going to come out for. And the only ones they have are Wii. PS3 and Xbox 360 and sorry to say this but uh, it's time to upgrade your system the PS2 is old it's 10 years old time to upgrade to the Xbox 360 or the PS3 I don't know but uh, I hope you guys enjoy these little vlogs that I'm bringing you I'm gonna bring you a lot more information as I know it but uh, that's all the information I know of right now Looks like E3 is coming up pretty soon, so uh, whenever I get any information, I will let you guys know. Thanks for checking out my videos, and Tony Pizza Guy, brag out.